The Victory Trigger from Tandem Cross is the most popular aftermarket trigger for popular rimfire firearms. And Sig Sauer P322 owners have made it very clear that they want an aftermarket trigger option from Tandem Cross for the platform. Well, the day has come, it's finally here. Let's dive in. Hi everyone, welcome to another Tandem Cross video. I'm Luke, and today we're gonna to be discussing the victory trigger for the Six Hour P322. If you're familiar with our other triggers, you know that we do our best to make them easy to install, but make a huge difference as far as the feel of the firearm and the trigger pull itself. And this trigger checks all the boxes. Flat face triggers are highly desired in the performance space, whether you shoot competition or just want something that's fast that you wanna train with, Flat face triggers seem to be a favorite, but typically they're seen as more of a premium option or package for a firearm. The Victory Trigger for the P322 is designed to automatically reduce pre and over travel movement and give you a shorter trigger pull that feels incredibly responsive. It's also gonna reset very positively as well. It serves as a CNC machine replacement to the plastic trigger, therefore eliminating more of that plastic flex on the shoe itself. The trigger has aggressive texturing as well, which gives you a nice non-slip surface, which is great if you're wearing gloves or if you have sweaty hands, which kind of covers you throughout the entire year, depending on where you live. We get all the seasons here. The texture on the trigger is gonna give you confidence that your trigger pulls are gonna be consistent and the angled stop makes sure you have optimal finger positioning. The trigger comes in two choices of color, either black or red, based on your preference. You can choose what you like. And also it's affordable and incredibly easy to install. If you're familiar with the platform, the shoe is really, really easy to change out. Let's kick it over to Tyler in the shop where he's gonna show you how easy you can get your P322 up and running with a Victory Trigger. Welcome to the installation portion of the video. Uh, we'll be putting in a red trigger into this uh, P322. As far as tools that you'll need for the install, uh, we provide the necessary screw and Allen key. The only thing you will need to bring is some medium strength thread locker to apply to the screw. That will be coming shortly. This is a very simple installation. To begin, we'll go ahead and clear the pistol. So, magazine is out. This has a chamber flag in it. But we'll go ahead and inspect the chamber as well. Make sure that is clear. Let the slide down in a safe direction. Dry fire. And now that the hammer has been dropped, we can remove the factory trigger shoe, whether it's the curved one like we show here or the factory flat trigger. Uh, you reach behind the trigger and just pull forward and it will snap free of the sheet metal stump that it is attached to. Then here you can sort of work it side to side, down and out of the pistol. At this point, now that the sheet metal component is exposed, you should be a little bit careful about that. Uh, the edges can be a little bit sharp. To install your new trigger, we'll just bring this up and in to the trigger guard, like so, with the textured part facing up, and then work the trigger up and onto those attachment nubs, lining them up with the slots in the back of the trigger, and then it'll slide right on like that. You'll be able to see clean through the hole in the back. That's how you know everything is properly lined up. And then we can take the set screw with the provided Allen key, apply a bit of medium strength thread locker to the threads on the screw, and then we will thread that into the trigger. So our trigger does not use the, uh, it doesn't flex around the attachment nub to uh, fix itself. We use a set screw that runs across the trigger to keep things nice and rigid. So we'll thread that screw in until it's approximately flush on either side of the trigger here which is like that. And then once that's been given 24 hours for the Loctite to cure, your trigger is fully installed. Really, it is that easy. So we can go ahead and check the trigger now. Again, it's clear. Nice aggressive texture. 
and drop. All right, back to Luke. As usual, thank you guys so much for the continued support watching the video. Make sure you drop that like, subscribe to the channel, leave any comments if you have any questions at all about the product or any of our products. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Thanks so much. See you next time. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video on whatever social media platform you use. I'm Luke with Tandem Cross, and we're here to make your good guns great. Keep up with us on social media for daily updates. I'll see you next time.